Bryce, congratulations on the win. Take me through that eighth inning. You're up there to lead off the inning. Uh, take me through that at bat and then the rest of the inning as it played out with Juan Soto delivering a really big knock for you guys. Yeah, I think, uh, you know, all game I thought we battled, the, you know, the best we could. And, you know, Max kept us, kept us in that ball game and, um, you know, big eighth inning right there. Uh, started it off and, you know, it's a tough guy out there, uh, you know, on the bump and just tried to get something over the plate that I could handle and, uh, you know, got in second. And Trey, of course, uh, you know, he gets on and then, uh, you know, Juan Soto delivers again for us. Four great at-bats tonight. Bryce uh, walk with 11 pitches and then the sack fly and then the dub within the walk on seven eight pitches sack fly uh, tell us where you are in feeling comfortable and and where you think you are um, swinging the bat and the mental aspect of it yeah I mean I uh, I think the past month it's uh, you know been tough of course but uh, my swings felt great um, I think for me it's just more of getting a pitch over the plate and not chasing um, I've chased a lot of pitchers pitches in the past you know a couple weeks and um, you know it's hurt me you know I need to take my walks and you know keep going and, you know when I'm doing that you know I'm one of the best in baseball and uh, you know this team needs me to do that each night and uh, you know it was a lot of fun going out there tonight and getting on base for my guys and you know driving in a run of course and you know winning a ball game you know you always want to <clears throat> get out there and do the things you can to help your team win and uh, I was able to do that tonight I want to I'm going to make this a little personal I've always had tremendous respect for you I uh, watch the way you work the way that you come to this ballpark how you've always been a guy that's been accessible to everybody and um, and just because you struggle doesn't mean that I respect you less I respect you more by the way you've comported yourself man you never hide you you're out there you you're not slamming your helmet you're running the balls out you're doing things that you're supposed to do uh, and you know that is just maturity that is something that a lot of people don't have and a lot of star players don't I've seen star players just kind of quit when things go bad for them but I'm just so proud of the way that you handle this deal and you know that you're gonna bust out of this thing and and you are uh, one of the top three or four talents in this game and um, I just I just proud of the way that you've responded through this and glad that you're starting to feel it and uh, and you have hit some balls hard people talk about it balls up the middle bullets to first um, and those things weigh on you because you want to hit so bad but um, you just keep swinging the bat big man I know it's all gonna come around for you I appreciate that Ray. that means a lot you know it's a uh... Every day is a new day, and, uh, you know, this clubhouse, we've got a great group of guys, and, you know, if one guy doesn't do it, the other guy does. And, you know, our staff and our, you know, <clears throat> our coaches in there, if that's Davey or Chip or Kay Long, I mean, these guys come into the field every single day ready to work, and uh, that's how you got to do it. Um, you know, definitely uh, you get into funk sometimes, and I've never uh, I've never struggled like this in my life. So, uh, you know, it's, it's definitely uh, a stepping stone to something great. And, you know, I'm excited to see uh, what I can do in the next couple of weeks. And, you know, we got a long season to go, and, you know, that's what it's all about. You know, winning ball games, getting to where we need to go, and being a team. Um, you know, I'm getting chills right now thinking about it. You know, we're, we're a great team. We're, we've got a great environment, and uh, I'm excited to, you know, make a run and, you know, get into the playoffs and do the things we need, we need to do to, you know, win a trophy. Bryce, last one for you, and then we'll let you go. I, I know the type of relationship that you have with Davey Martinez and how much you value the communication between the two of you. What has it meant to you over these last couple weeks, the way that he has continued to show faith in you, show confidence in you, and stand by you throughout all this? Yeah, I mean, I think as a team, uh, you know, he has confidence in everybody in that clubhouse, and you know me, Calco, you know, I have the most confidence in myself than anybody in the world, so, um, you know, going in every single day and having a manager that his door is wide open for us for any guy that goes in there, it's a lot of fun, you know, I, I've always said it, you know, the past couple weeks or even you know, the past couple of months, uh, I, I'm having a blast. I mean, I might uh, I might be struggling a little bit, but I'm having a blast going out and playing for this guy every single day. I want to run through a brick wall for him because he's that type of manager. You know, he's got our backs, and, uh, you know, he's all about family. He's all about this clubhouse being a family and loving on each other and doing the things we can to, you know, help win ball games no matter what. And, uh, I mean, I couldn't ask for a better manager. I mean, the guy is, uh, the guy is unbelievable. Bryce, congratulations on the win, and we're looking forward to seeing many more big things from you and from this team. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, big man.